All right, so here we've got a question. It's got some A's, some B's, some C's. We've got some indices. We've got some brackets. And Butch is going to answer it, and he's going to tell me the answer is one. I wasn't ready. It's not my fault. Answer's one. Why is the answer one? Everything's to the power of zero. Yeah, anything to the power of zero is one, and that whole block of stuff is to the power of zero. All right, next one. What if it was to the power of one? I thought you have the individual. Then it would be itself. Well, you could. But you're going to do, what are you going to do to that? There's nothing to do. Here you could cancel out the A's, you could take the B away from that and have B to the power of 4 and C, o, and so that would be, you'd have, the A's would cancel out, you'd have B to the power of 4 uh, over C to the power of 3 and still raised to the power of 0. Anything to the power of 0 is 1. And then the next one. And then the next one. What is it? One eight. Okay, let's do it in two steps. 2 to the power of minus 3 is the same as... Excellent. And then you can do that. Okay, just so you remember that the negative indice, take it. Now, the thing is, what if you had 1 over 2 to the minus 3? Are we going to have one of them? No, we don't have one of them. Oh, no, we don't. What if you had 1 over x to the minus 3? Okay. So if we had that, what would that be the same as? It's easier than you think. Well done. No, nah, it's already a negative. It was a negative down there, so if I move it to the top of the fraction, if I move it from the denominator to the numerator, it's going to become a positive. All right. Uh, we've only got oh, plenty of time. Okay, write in index form, 1 over x squared. In other words, we don't want it as a fraction. X to the minus power of 2. Yeah, x to the power of minus 2. 3 over x to the power of 5. This is where it gets interesting. It's easy. Close, it's three times. Now do the bottom bit. Minus to the minus five. X to the minus five. All it did was bring that X part to the top. Yeah. Okay, what about C? Um, five to the power of X. Close, five X to the minus one. Next one. Now this one's an interesting one. X to the power of minus one. Not X to the power of one. Minus one. Minus everything. X. Everything. One over x to the power of two. Not quite. No, 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 no. We're in a bracket and then two to the power of two. Well, that looks like you were close. You know how like you do on the tree? You minus one thing. Inverse. That's it. It means inverse, which funnily enough is exactly right. It is one over sine or one over tan. All good?